Hey guys, so I wanted to show you a project that I just finished up a little while ago. It's a, it's, well, it's a bottle opener, as you can see, and I've got my favorite NFL team there. Um, but what's different about this is that it has this um, rare earth magnet in the back, and what you do is, you know, you've got your bottle right, and when you open it, it just kind of drops the cap and it catches it right there. So it's pretty cool. You know, I've seen these in uh, some craft fairs, and I've seen these online, and I always kind of wondered how, how people made these. Um, so you know, it's a very simple project and uh, I've got more detailed pictures as well as um, uh, some links of where I've got the hardware at on my website at woodlogger.com and uh, you know of course here comes the video of what I did to make this. So it's just a simple board and I decided to just use my miter saw for the cut on that and um, you know I took that over to uh, the router table and just did a simple chamfer um, all around the, the whole sides of it. Um, next up, I um, wanted to drill a keyhole slot into the back of it for uh, mounting. And I've got this uh, this sort of drill guide from uh, Rocker that I like to use. And, uh, you know, it does a pretty good job. It, it helps kind of keep everything centered and helps, it, helps you uh, line things up a little bit easier when you're uh, making your cuts. Next up, I uh, head over to the drill press, and uh, I used a, a two-inch Forstner bit uh, to drill the hole that I needed for my magnet. And I probably could have got away with a smaller size uh, magnet, uh, maybe a one-inch or a one-and-a-half inch. But since this is really the first time I've ever used anything like this, I, I kind of wanted to go big. So, um, you know, I drilled about a uh, half an inch in, and uh, it worked pretty well. So after I finished with the drill press, I moved on to sanding uh, the whole board front and back. And then I decided to use a, a golden oak finish. Um, it's just a Minwax uh, finish. And um, the stain on it looks really great. It's, it's an oak board, um, so the oak finish on it really just, uh, it, it just makes it look uh, kind of that classic, that classic look. But, uh, but I like it. I mean, I think it turned out really well. And after I finished uh, staining it, I did go back and put a, um, a glossy um, sealer on top of it just to uh, protect it. And I, I think I actually did two coats of that, as I recall. So after everything uh, finished drying, I uh, inserted the, uh, the magnet that I had for it. And it was really a perfect fit. It, it worked just great. And uh, later I did do uh, some epoxy to help hold that in there. Although I don't really know that I needed to do that. And then the uh, last piece really is just to uh, attach the uh, the bottle opener itself. And, um, you know, I did pre-drill holes for that. It's, you don't see it in the video, but, um, uh, you yeah, know, it's pretty straightforward. So that's pretty much it. That's the uh, the bottle opener with the uh, magnetic catch at the bottom. It's a it's a pretty straightforward, fun, easy project to do. And as always, you can check out my website at woodlogger.com for uh, more information about it.